Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. My little space on the interwebs. My name is Shiv or Shivon, but you can call me Shiv. Most people call me Shiv. Anyway, in today's video I have a Primark haul for you. This time around I went to Lakeside, which is in Essex. I've had a few comments, well not comments, but I've had a few kind of people telling me that the Lakeside Primark is amazing, so I went and checked it out. We drove down very early on Friday morning, like the last Friday since this video goes up. We drove down and yeah, I had a good look around. We were a little bit stretched for time, but the Primark is massive. I think I prefer the Milton Keynes one but I don't know I think I'm gonna go to the lakeside one again at some point in the near future maybe not next month but in the near future to check it out again when I'm not stretched for time but I did enjoy it and yeah this is my monthly Primark haul. If you want to see what I got, please carry on watching. I shall show you what I picked up. Please don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below. It would mean the absolute world. And it's lovely to have new faces here on my little channel. If you're like subscribed already and you're joining me again, hello. Thanks for coming back and let's just crack into the haul. Okay, so the first bag, I've got two bags this time, two bags of stuff is full of accessories and shoes and things so i'm gonna jive good jive i'm gonna jive straight into it so the first thing i picked up was this white bag i had one similar to this from misguided and i owned it i've literally just got rid of it <laughs> i owned it for like two or three years and i loved it except the zip broke and i just didn't get around to fixing the zip and i spotted this and i was like oh my god that's like a misguided bag except it doesn't that bag didn't have these gold studded details on it but i really like this this is six pounds it comes with a strap as well i think it's really pretty and we'll go with loads of summery outfit and that was only six pounds that's a complete bargain i also picked up these amazing pink fluffy sliders these are six pounds and my size is a size six for anybody who's interested in my feet um but yeah these are amazing they're really comfy and you just chuck them on you look super cute just if you're running errands or just if you want to feel a bit you know extra and they give me clueless vibes i don't know why but they do i think they are so cute and i think six pounds is a complete bargain i wouldn't really want to pay anything more than like 15 pounds for a pair of fluffy sliders anyway but i think these are amazing and and I remember when like fluff, fluff, fluffly, fluffy side slide, I can't, just can't talk, fluffy sliders came into fashion like a year ago and like a year and a half ago maybe and I was a bit like, I don't know, I don't feel it. And then I'm like obsessed with them. That always happens with me with fashion trends, like the cycling shorts thing or the sliders. Like I'm never really feeling it and then I try them out for myself and I like it. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, these are really nice and I cannot wait to wear them. I've got another pair of shoes and I think this is my favorite thing in the whole haul because they're just so bright and extra and amazing. And they are these amazing yellow heels. I just thought they were so cool. These were 14 pounds, again in a size six. I tried them on and they do feel quite comfy. I wanted to get a pair of blue heeled sandals as well, but the pair I tried on were quite uncomfortable, but these are really comfy. And they have like a little bit of like a squidgy bit where your toe goes, like no toe, like the little pads of your feet. <laughs> like for a dog, I don't know. But like where your foot goes, they have little pads and it's really nice. And I just thought they were so freaking cool. Like they're so cool and they're like probably the brightest pair of heels I own yeah they are they're so cool I'm obsessed and I don't think I can think of anything else to say apart from oh my god they're so cool <laughs> I also picked up a fake tanning mitt these are two pounds this is the Primark bronze keep glowing self tan applicator it's got a kind of mitt side that you use on the back of your hand which you obviously don't put the tan on and then you have the foamy bit I just needed a new fake tanning mitt mine was absolutely disgusting two pounds you can't go wrong at the tills on the way out I I picked up these lashes they're from the Suzanne Jackson 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 range with Primark these lashes are amazing I tried out a similar pair I think they were in the shade in the style Milan last time these ones are in New York and they're big on the outer corner so they're my favorite type of lash they're really wispy and they were only five pounds I think obviously five pounds for Primark lashes sounds expensive but if I was going to buy a pair of eyelore lashes they would be like six pounds anyway so I think that's amazing and they're really wispy and fluffy then I got a refillable kind of thing that I wanted to stock back up on and this is the primer water if you watch my makeup tutorials you know I use this in every single video I'm just obsessed with it I think it's so good it is two pound I 
I also like to use this for dampening my brushes when I apply a highlighter or like shadow to the lid if I want to make it more intense but yeah I really really like this product so I picked another one of this up. I also picked up a pair of really really cool sunnies and these are little hearts. They are so freaking cool. I just think they're awesome. They were only £3. Is that a scratch on them? Please don't be a scratch. Okay, we're out, we're out, we're out with there. No scratches on these glasses, they're just a bit of fluff, but they are so cool and they were only three pounds. Obviously I'll take this off. Should I take this off now? Shall I? Okay, I'll take it off in a second, but it comes with a little sunglasses case, which is really cool as well. But they are just these cool sunglasses with little hearts on them. They're sitting a little bit wonky because this is weighing it down, but you see how cool they look. And I'm gonna wear these to VR Festival. I don't usually like wearing sunnies just because I find that these little bits rub off my makeup here and I just don't like it, so I'd rather just squint and have this bit of my makeup stay in place. I know some people put like tissue here, but like I don't really want to walk around with tissue on my nose. I don't know. But I really like them. I thought for three pounds they are so cool and because only three pounds, like say if I lose them at the festival or if I drop them or anything like that, then it's really not that bad at all so got some cool sunnies then i also saw this in the beauty section while i was looking for my primer water and it is this lash addict eyelash case now nick was actually the one nick is my boyfriend by the way if you are a new follower but he was the one who actually said you need it because when i take off my lashes i just leave them like everywhere and yeah so he wanted me to get this i thought fair enough it was only three pounds it holds up to three pairs of lashes but it's really cute and it just says lash addict across here i just thought this was so cool and perfect for traveling. Spink of the devil, just replying to me fella. Next, not really beauty bitch, but just kind of toiletries, I guess. I got some tissues. These were 50p. They just say achu on them. They're quite cute. Obviously, they're not like a fashion accessory. They're for a purpose. I got these tissues because I'm going to a art festival and I'm just going to top up my backpack and make sure I've got everything I need kind of thing. So I thought tissues would be really handy and they were only 50p. I also picked up these, which you might be a bit like, okay, TMI, but it's really essential. And they are feminine hygiene wipes, you know, like Fresh wipes or something. And they were a pound for two packs of 15 wipes which is so good because I only need to take one pack with me but it's just because at festivals and stuff obviously the kind of toilets the porter loose run out of blue rolls so you've got to make sure you have wipes so you stay clean yes <laughs> I'm going to do a festival essentials video as well so look, definitely look out for that because these like most of this stuff will be featuring in that video I also picked up a pair well not a pair like a lot of pairs of earrings. Oh, one of them is broken. Is it broken? No, it's not, it's just got caught. Okay, that's all right, but I got these hoops. I only really got them for the rose gold heart hoops. I think they are so cute. I don't know if you can see that, the little rose gold hoops just there. The pack of like however many earrings this is, I can't bother to count, but you get only two pounds. So you get gold hoops, silver hoops, and some rose gold ones. I think this was so cool. Um, this for the hearts, they come with the little studs as well. I'm not really too big in into like stud earrings. I don't know why I just never really tend to wear them. But yeah, I thought these were really cute, so I picked those up. Now moving on to clothes. First of all, I got this really sexy bra. Like it's just, oh my god, you just die at how gorgeous it is. <laughs> um, totally kidding. This is just a nude t-shirt bra just because I needed a really just basic ugly bra for when I'm wearing like a white t-shirt because I've heard that if you wear a white t-shirt, you should wear nude underwear and if you wear nude you should wear white or something I don't know something like that so I'm gonna try it out and just see if it kind of stops you seeing the bright white bra underneath and this was really cheap this was two pounds so I just got this just because I needed it <laughs> then I got some pretty underwear I haven't bought any like pretty underwear in a while like usually my underwear is for a purpose like my bras are like the push-up bra like the strapless bra like I always forget to buy um like actual pretty bras so I picked up this set here Nick approved of it <laughs> um but I got this striped one here with like lace across the top which is nice they have a decent amount of padding in them as well I like a bit of padding um and then you get this red bra as well which has this lace lacy bit underneath which I think is really really pretty and super flattering and then oh how much was this this was where is the tag that was 12 pounds and then I got the matching underwear which was five pounds so 17 pounds for two pairs of underwear which is not bad at all so the first pair of knickers look like this they're just like standard knickers with like lace on the back do you think they're quite pretty then I also got the red matching ones which come together as well I thought that was so pretty I feel like when you wear nice underwear you really do feel like good about yourself do you know what I mean? Okay, so the first thing I've picked up out of the clothing bag is 
not actually for me, it was for Nick. And it is this blue t-shirt that says Brooklyn on it. And it was £2.50, nothing really interesting here, but I thought I would show you anyway. I like to buy Nick t-shirts, and I think this colour would look lovely on him. <laughs> I got loads of t-shirts in this haul. The next t-shirt I got was for me, this is £4. And this is just a yellow t-shirt with Oh Baby written across it. I've seen it on like Primark's Instagram or something, I was like, oh my god, I have to have that t-shirt. It's just yellow, like a pastel yellow with white oh baby written across it i love it i think it's super summery and cute and i'm also wearing primark's t-shirt that says do everything with love in this video i just love a slogan tee i think they're so cute and yeah i love the color of it i could <gasps> i could pair it with like a white skirt and those yellow heeled sandals yes Oh my god, I'm feeling it. Yeah, okay. When I finish filming this video, I am going to try it on with that. Yes, 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 yes. Next, I got a dress. This is a red midi dress, which was only £6. I got it in a size 14. I'm usually a size 12 or a 10, just kind of for reference, because I find these midi dresses usually to be very clingy in the wrong places. So I thought if I just go up one size, it will fit a bit nicer, which it does. And this is a red knitted not knitted, but like that ribbed material midi dress. I think it is super cute. You can kind of see it here, but I'll do a little try on clip for you to show you what it looks like. Super cute, and I absolutely love the colour red. I think I'm going to wear this to the zoo. I'm going to the zoo on my birthday. I feel like this would be a cool zoo outfit with like white converse and a denim jacket. Feeling it. The next thing I got, like, okay, I just need to go in a little bit of a backstory here. So grab yourself a drink. Anyway, um, <laughs> I am obsessed with Transformers. Like, I love those films. Anyone who knows me properly will know that I love Transformers. The first film is like my favourite film of all time. I know, like, that is probably quite unusual to some people. Most people are like, oh, it might be Mean Girls or like, I don't know. Lord of the Rings. I don't know, like a really big famous film, but I love Transformers. I think it's amazing. And I saw this sweatshirt in the loungewear section, and I'm not even joking you, all I could think of was like Bumblebee and how I'm gonna look like Bumblebee. Look! It's this yellow cropped sweatshirt with a black stripe down the side. It's super simple. This was only eight pounds and it has like a nice fleecy lining on the inside, so it's gonna be super cozy. But I thought this was so cute. You could just wear it with jeans or leggings or whatever you wanted to do, but I just love it because I feel like I'm gonna be Bumblebee. Bumblebee. I'm gonna be Bumblebee because he is my favorite transformer and I love it. Can you can you just can we just talk about it? Yes. Bumblebee is in the house. <laughs> okay, so another kind of nerdy thing here. I actually said to Nick that I wanted to get me and him a matching one, and it is a Black Panther themed t-shirt. He's got me into all the superhero films, um, but it just says Wakanda forever on it, and this was eight pounds. Obviously, it was a little bit more pricey just because it's like a brand thing with Disney that Primark are doing, but I don't think eight pounds is bad at all. And um, I'm probably gonna wear this as a pajama top. I don't think I'll wear it out and about because I can't really picture how I'd style it but I think it is so freaking cool and I, I just think the warriors and Black Panther are unreal and oh my god oh my god if you've seen Infinity War that scene it's not even a spoiler it's not even a spoiler but when she's like why am she up there this whole time and then and then when they go Wakanda forever I'm just I've, be I've become a nerd <laughs> okay so I got another t-shirt I forget which one this is this was four pounds and it's another slogan tee which is just really cute and it says perfectly in perfect I thought this was really cool and I have a red like mini skirt I think this will go really nicely because they're red on the t-shirt but I just love a slogan tee I think you can never have too many and they can be styled up in so many ways <gasps> Video idea, how to style up slogan tees. Yeah, cause I wanna get more into like fashion content. Yeah, oh my God, I'm adding it to my list. I'm adding it to my list of video ideas. Oh, I completely forgot I got this. <laughs> Oh dear, this has been a really interesting haul. Like, I feel like every Primark haul I've done so far this year, because I'm doing the monthly now, has become so different. So like, one of them was like really stylish pieces that can wear lots of things, like the black and the white boots, the black bag, the other one was like summery bits, and the other one was like loads of makeup stuff, and this one's just full of loads of nerdy things. But I picked up this Game of Thrones top. This was for Nick, like I got it for him. And it was reduced from eight pounds to three pounds, which I was not complaining about. See, I got him this top because he loves Game of Thrones. I couldn't get into it myself, but he loves it. So there you go. I got him with this little tee and we have our geeky t-shirts 
for life. <laughs> Is that the end of my haul? That's the end of my haul. So this haul has been a bit of a mismatch of kind of lots of little bits. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you are a geek like me and you like t-shirts like that, then leave a comment below and I'll love to chat to you. Um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give it a big thumbs up if you did enjoy it. Please look out on my Instagram for me styling up some fashion content. I'm so excited to get going with a fashion post. My Instagram is www.instagram.com slash Siobhan Makeup Biz. Siobhan. Siobhan Makeup Biz is what I meant to say. But yeah, I really did hope you enjoyed this video. If you aren't subscribed, please subscribe. It really would mean the world. And if you've made it this far, despite all my rambling, then you are amazing. And I thank you so much for that. But yeah, I should see you in my next video. Thanks so much for watching. Bye. Bye.